Alright. Alright. <laughs> Salutations, Nicky Rickies. Welcome back to another video. Today, we are playing Monster Pro. Once again, I'm joined by the most lovely person in the world, Emma. Hi! Um, Do you want to tell them that we're filming all these in the same day? They, they can tell we're in the same clothing. <laughs> But they never know, because we're going to be releasing okay. this. Okay, anyway, something thing. happens to Nick Rick. Oh, fancy. Surprise. Yeah, all right. Let's get into this. All what right. What happens to you? On Saturday night, you're at a cool pizza place that looks that cooks pizza in a real pizza oven. Little did you expect that when the chef opens the door, you get pe you get your pizza, Damien appears from the flames. How, how, how does that work? Can he teleport through fire? He, he has he been waiting inside the oven all this time just to make a kick-ass entrance? Ah, the mystery. My dude, I fucking hate needing people's help, but I might need yours. <laughs> don't let it to, uh, don't let it get to your head, or I'll stab you. Oh no, it's already gotten to his head. It, yeah, everything goes to my head. It, uh, everything goes to my ego. <laughs> or I'll stab you. So I don't have to owe you anything. Especially his, especially the air that he breathes, it goes all the way up to his head. Aww. Enough threats. Here's the deal, fuckhead. I might or might not feel attracted by your buddy, Emma. Oh, he loves me. You know the one, always making absurd choices, being equal parts stupidly sexy and sexily stupid, and with a nice booty. But I don't want to get my feelings hurt by rushing into, lo uh, into love without proper judgment. My dads always say, if you love someone, shoot them and see what happens. Great fatherly advice, right? <laughs> no. <laughs> Thing is, Principal Giant Spider, my therapist, and the rule of law all seem to think that shooting someone to check if, the, if they're the one is not very legal. I don't know what the word legal means. It's, neither do I. <laughs> they have strongly recommended that I do all that on what they call a theoretical level. Like, imagine the whole thing. But imagine, imagining is for losers. And yes. since you both know, uh, since you both know Emma, and you're a loser yourself, I thought you <laughs> could tell me what would Emma do if I were to shoot her. Emma was all about, if, believe it or not, uh, uh, she would not be into it. I see. So I could. Um, no. No, I know. I would never. <laughs> Emma's all about getting shot. She uh, goes to the doctor every day just to get a shot. And shots are the only thing she does when partying. So I think you can give her a shot. <laughs> Whoa. That's convenience. I have a feeling dating me could increase someone's chances of getting shot. Or stabbed. You don't get uh, to be as big and as an asshole as me without t making s some enemies along the way. Oof. I would feel bad if my loved one was getting shot because of me. But knowing Emma is so into getting shot, it's a relief. I fucking hate guilt. Okay, it I, seems like my heart isn't being a drunk idiot this time. <laughs> I might be onto something. Nice! And who knows? If she uh, is so into getting shot, I might add some spice into my foreplay, if you know what I mean. I mean, shooting Emma before having sex with her. Help. Just to be clear. Oh, 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 never mind. I got, I got my explanation. You have fun with that. <laughs> Wowie, you're welcome. <laughs> Both for getting you some demon dick and <laughs> for the blood loss you're about to experience. You have too much blood anyway. It, you get plus three charm and for being such a good friend. It's it's always worth the blood loss if I get good demon dick. <laughs> Alright. Every Everybody chooses something cool. Say your choice out loud for the rest of the players before clicking. I was about to click. Alright, something cool. Um, Ice. FNAF. <laughs> you're going to win automatically. <laughs> Player orders decided based on how awesome it would be if Japan built a vending machine. FNAF. <laughs> but they already have ice machines. <laughs> Alright, baby. Okay. I'm gonna go party. Hey, that's my me. Kiss counter. <laughs> oh, yeah. That day during recess, you start a half hour rave that goes full crazy. That day during... You're talking to Juan, the small no, man. Juan, <laughs> the small magical Latino cat. When, when he tells you that you won't ever be as fun as Bob the scary clown. Damn. Fuck. fuck Roasted. You. Oh shit. You accept the challenge. You go straight to Bob, stab him several times, 
open his bleeding chest and eat some of his guts in order to consume his fun. Really? Do you think do you think that's how it's, this works? Well, it is. You gain plus two fun from poor Bob. Next. <laughs> you see Damien beating the piss out of a goblin, like he always does when he's depressed. You go over and ask him, what's up? It's this whole heir to the throne of hell thing. It's really bumming me out. I hate being a prince of hell. And I'm going to hate being a king of hell even more. I mean, how am I supposed to rebel against authority when I am the authority? Ugh! Not even beating the piss out of this goblin is cheering me up. Damon continues to beat the piss out of the goblin, but his heart clearly isn't in it. I mean, is there anything right I can do as a king of hell? Literally anything? You're forgetting about the ultimate way to fight authority. Total war. Kings have harem, er, harems. <laughs> and I definitely join yours. Which one do you want, babe? Ooh, which one would be more fun? Total war. Alright, I'm just doing the clicking today. War? What the fuck is that good for? Oh. You're not getting good luck at this. <laughs> you need to step up your game if you want to win this guy. <laughs> okay, every time you make a choice, go with the opposite one. <laughs> Answer! Absolutely nothing! Violence is only cool when you're doing it to people who are weaker than you. War is all about armies fighting armies. I'm all about armies fighting civilians. <laughs> but you're not a prince. I guess you'll never understand. Uh -uh. Unless I make you understand. Come to think of it, you look a lot weaker than me. Whoever coined the phrase, what doesn't kill you makes you stronger, never got a beaten from Damien. You lose two fun and one boldness. Why are you talking so quiet this episode? Rawr. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna go... Um... Where, where they should like it? There! There we go. Okay, that day you skip class and just hang out in the bathrooms because you respect no authority. <laughs> On the way there, you run into Miami, the Ani girl. She offers you some of her weird Japanese energy drink. You take a sip. It tastes crazy as hell. You need to check the contents of the no, shit. Mimi. I don't care. Granite seed extract. Benzoic acid. 50 milligrams of caffeine and 100 milli milligrams of boldness. Oh, well, wasn't that bad at all. You gain plus two boldness and thank, thank Mami. Mamimi and proceed to the bathrooms. Yeah, there's Mimi in her name. On your way out, you sp oh, out of the bathrooms. On your way out, you spot Polly still wearing that lab coat she stole from the human party the other night. She takes it off and throws it at you to get your attention. Yo, yo, yo! That human party convinced me. I want to be a scientist. But not just any kind of party scientist. Oh. What's a party scientist, you ask? Why, just a scientist who's dedicated to discovering the secrets to the raddest party. Okay. Through a severe, se through a series of extremely scientific experience, experiments, shush, I aim to discover what exactly makes a party <laughs> good. Sorry. So I can distill whatever is, whatever it, it whatever it is, whatever it is into a vial and drink it. Or, you know, just have really dope parties all the time. Anyway, I'm going to the... To, to a bar mitzvah. To a oh, bar, nets, bar, bar mitzvah. mitzvah tonight, and I need your scientific advice. What could we do to push this party over the edge? The electric side, but with electricity chemistry. Okay, so I think she would like the electric slide, but I'm gonna do my answer. The only thing I know how to answer when it comes to when people are trying to be smart with me. Chemistry! Oh my fucking god, I'm trying to piss her off at this point. I'm trying to join you. <laughs> I'm sorry, honey. 
<laughs> Later that night. Yes, I've done it. I had to tear. Right. Yes, I've done it. I had to tear the hearts out of an animatronic bomb. Of an atomic bomb. Atomic bomb. <laughs> <laughs> of an animatronic bomb. Atomic bomb. You have an on the brain. <laughs> but I've done it. <laughs> I've isolated the element part party really. Party rium. Party. Partyum. <laughs> oh, partyum. Partium, the life of the party. Now to slip my solution into the bar mitzvah's water supply. The effects are instantaneous. All around you, boys are becoming men, and men are becoming a party animals. All around you are familiar things. Aww. No, I might watch any. Mm. And not just all around the bar mitzvah, all around the city. The bar mitzvah's water supply it was also the city's water supply. You party so hard you cause serious damage to the local infrastructure. Mayor Grim Reaper declares the next day National Hangover Day. Whoa, what just happened? Oh wait, I remember. Science! <laughs> Baby. <laughs> Chemical warfare has never been so fun. Chem oh. Even plus two, uh, two fun and plus one smart. I read that as criminal warfare. Alright. Well, I think that's going to do it for this episode. Wait, wait, wait. Everybody chooses a food. Say what your choice. Say your choice out loud before clicking. Chicken wings. French onion soup. French onion soup. Yeah. Okay. Players or order is decided based on how filthy this sounds. Hey, darling, my French is it, it your okay? Your French onion soup is is moist and, re and ready for you. Hey, darling, my chicken wings is more. Yeah, no. I, Yours is more filthy, so you're first. All right. So with that being said, I want to say thank you guys all so much for watching. Make sure you guys comment, like, and subscribe. Turn on that notification bell so you guys never miss a video from me. And thank you so much for my beautiful baby from joining. Um, I love you guys all, and we'll see you guys in the next uh, video. Roll the credits.